Hi, this is Mr Winter. I'm going to multiply 14 by 235 using the grid method. First of all, I need to split up this number or partition it into the different pieces. I've got the ones column, the tens column and the hundreds. So I know that this number is 235 which is made up of 200, the 3 is in the 10 so it's worth 30, the 5 is in the 1 so it's worth 5. And I'm going to draw a grid beneath that. I'm now going to partition my 14. 14 is made up of a 10 and a 4. I'm now going to draw two rows because I've got two parts of this number and three columns because I've got three parts of this number. Now I'm going to start off with the smaller numbers. 4 times 5 is 20. 4 times 30, well, 4 times 3 is 12, so 4 times 30 is going to be 10 times 12, 120. And here, 4 times 200. I know that 4 times 2 is 8, so 4 times 200 is 800. Okay, moving up to the top row. This should be quite easy because it's 10 times, and I know that 10 times any number is shifting the digits of that number one step to the left and adding zero as a place marker. So 10 times 5 is going to be 50. 10 times 30 is going to be 300. And 10 times 200 is going to be 2,000. Now I'm going to add across and then find the total at the bottom. So 2,350. 2,350. Here we have 800 plus 100 is 900, 920, 940. Now I'm going to be careful to put my 940 so that the 900 is in the same place underneath the hundreds of this number, 940. And I'm going to add up those two parts, giving me 0, 5 plus 4 is 9, 3 plus 9 is 12, 2 plus 1 is 3. Now let's just check, see if that looks about right. I know that 10 times 235 would be 2,350, and I've got about 4 more lots of that, so it's about 1,000 more, so it's going to be about 3,350, so that's looking about right. I've, I'm happy that I've done a check there. And that's how you use the grid method to multiply a two-digit number by a three-digit number.